Big problem at Chinook Pier in Grand Haven is forcing business owners to find new storefronts now this spring. The city says they first discovered the issue last summer and they spent thousands of dollars to take care of it, but now the mold is back. The city is unsure if they'll restore the building at all now. News 8's Whitney Burney spoke with city leaders about what's to come. The Chinook Pier houses about 12 different businesses, all of which have been closed for the winter season. When the time comes around for them to reopen in the spring, the city says they won't be able to call this building home, and they're not sure when things will get back to normal. Yeah, we were hoping this wouldn't happen, but our best advice at this point in time is that they, uh, they can't open. Closing time at Chinook Pier. Basically, we're going to have to gut these buildings and clean them out and then restore everything that was disturbed. This after high water made its way into the property's crawl space, causing mold. The city spent $25,000 to fix the issue, but it didn't work. The city now warning tenants the space won't be safe for use in spring 2020. City leaders are now in discussion about making the historic depot available for some tenants. We're going to do what we can to, find, to help our tenants have a soft landing from this. Mayor Bob Manetza says initial estimates put the cost to fix the problem at about $1 million. With the city already working to fund several infrastructure projects, this project is up in the air. The city's resources are being pulled a lot of directions. It's nice to have, but when you're talking about um, storm systems being inundated and massive erosion and all that, that not necessarily the top of our list. The city plans to discuss this issue and their options moving forward at tonight's city council meeting. You can find the agenda at woodtv.com. Reporting here in Grand Haven, Whitney Burney, News 8.